hi guys what's popping over here so today i went to the university of all actually on my flight i had a missing luggage so i don't have an address yet i didn't know how long it would take so i decided to put my university address which is university of all so i came to the school i didn't know my way around so this is me just walking around the school i think um yeah i saw a lady and she directed me i think i'm actually at the back of the building yeah i'm actually at the black at the back where little construction is going on what's meant this school is beautiful i really really love it so that's me asking the lady for direction that's why there's a little pause over there and she directed me so sticking to work just admiring the flowers the trees the horticulture and natural surroundings just um admiring the the cleanliness and everything yeah so those are some areas you could sit and wait there are some doors and alley and all of that so i'm coming out this is still like the back though this is still like the back of the school so i saw a door right there where they wrote chemistry so I know that I have no business with chemistry. So I just said, let me just ask in case I see anybody in there. So normally what I'm used to in Nigeria is that anytime you get into discovery, it's so busy with vendors selling this and selling that. You see um, officials in the office gossiping <laughs> and just doing nothing. Instead, so a lot of lottering around going on. But yeah, I think school is on break right now, so there's really nobody in school around here. So I think everybody's just on break to get themselves back against September. So this is chemistry, and this is the back. So I got in here, tried opening the door, but... The door seems locked. That's when I knew that I was in the wrong direction. So this is me trying to go back and at the same time taking my time. At this point in time, I'm not even getting cold yet because I was just wearing a short gown and slides. No winter jacket, no winter caps, no shoes and all of that. I'm sure people will be wondering, ah, what of all the issue does this lady has in her body? But me, I was not feeling cold actually. But I think my hands, I was feeling it in my hands because of the thick gown sweater I wore. So I was not feeling it in my chest just yet. So this is me lost. I was looking at that direction board. I'm not seeing anything like um, student affairs or like a reception the front decks or something i just needed a little clue so this weather force i really don't know what that is wow just look at these gardens blossoming i just like it i really really do like it um i can see a bridge like that's a bridge. I wonder what the the bridge takes someone to. But I didn't climb. I didn't climb out to. I was just more concerned about where I could get my lost baggage. So that's the car park, and it's so beautiful. I wonder if they also park on top too, because that looks like a balcony. The orderly man, I mean, there are no cars on the road. That this a car park. In where I'm coming from, you just park anywhere. Just park anywhere in school. Nobody comes to tow you or all of that. So I think yeah, you just have to book for a parking space. 
you have your own designated parking space. So nobody comes there to take your space, whether you're in or not. And if anybody's come to take your space when you're not in, it will not be more than like five minutes because they don't know when you're driving or not. So I think that's the best one. Instead of having cars all over the place, parked, trying to do eat people and all of that, causing traffic, vendors. In fact, the chaos was just too much. Too much chaos, actually. So, just trying to find my way. At this point in time, I'm already feeling a little freezy. My food and my hands were already um, mildly cold. Not so cold yet. It was just mildly cold. I think it's something that was still bearable. I got to still bear it and all of that. So luckily, I'm seeing some people. And I took a walk with them. And they said they were going to my direction. Lucky me. So walking towards the direction. And I am glad. So... This is them showing me around and telling me to go to the courtyard. So when I go to the building called courtyard, they should be able to direct me from there. So those two men were actually very, very, um, very, very accommodative. Yeah. And they asked me questions like, oh, what course are you coming from? Oh, there's a big signboard that shows all the direction of the school. Oh, do you know you pass the back of the school and all of that? They were very, very... And their English was not so fast. It was not so twisted. It was just... Well, that's it. So I've come out from the school now. I think I lost my way again around the year. And then I just stood. Yeah. So now they've told me where the courtyard is and I'm walking towards the school courtyard. So that's where I'm going to ask questions on, yeah, um, where I could find my lost baggage. I was standing in front of the door and the door refused to open. I knew it was automatic door. I just didn't have strength again. I think I was already freezing at this point. So I signaled to the lady in there and told her to please come out front. You can see my palm there. That's basically what I wore. So the lady is coming out front and she stood in a place where the door could open and I asked questions. Oh, I actually posted my missing baggage from the flight to the school. I don't know where I could go to lay my claim on my bag. And she said, oh, you should go to the post room. The post room is where all postages go to. So if you use the University of All as your address to collect your um, NI number, your BRP number, or whatever number have you, then you should go to the post room to collect them and that's what she just explained to me i'm so glad i saw people that are nice and accommodative and it was just so awesome so i actually started going but then i didn't know the direction i went back i was like please (laughs) excuse me you told me to go to the post room yeah i got that but where is the post room and then she said Oh, just come from, you go forward, you turn to your right, you go more forward, you turn to your left, and then you see the post room. I was like, ah, thank you so much. The courtyard, I really don't know what goes on there right now, seeing that I'm just a new perspective and international student. So this is actually not... A detailed video yet so I'm just here to claim my baggage yeah British Airways um, left my baggage at the airport 
all the way from my home country. And it never followed me to London, neither did it follow me to Manchester. So they had to rebuild to me and all of that. And I was like, mm, please, oh. I asked this man again. I don't video their faces, so they don't feel uncomfortable talking to me. So I asked him, please, I'm looking for the post room. And he was like, oh, I, it has been long since I've been here. I, I don't really remember details of where and which where in this um, uni anymore. But I think you should look at the library. When you look at the library, you will see some signposts and then just follow it. And I said, oh, the library, nice. So I took the clue, you turn left, you turn right, and then you see the library. Okay, I got you. So this place is the spa. Yeah, the spa, you get Africans, get their nails done, get their hair done, pack up your bicycle, their ATM withdrawals, ATM machines, the restaurants. So this is spa. I have, we have spa in our home country. And I don't know if it's like the same. I really don't have that information. <laughs> if it's the same though. So just taking a walk. Work, work, work. You know, at this point in time I was officially freezing my hands was like i held a serious block of clue of a block of water you know it was called block yeah like i held a block and oh i just put my two hands in the fridge for like um 10 minutes it was numb yeah my hands and my feet was numb because I wasn't wearing um, warm clothing. I was wearing just my palm flaps, flops rather. <laughs> I was just wearing my flops and my um, sweater gown and I got my hair covered with my wig and that's all. I didn't wear a winter jacket or any other thing. So. That's just it. This is me trying to locate the library. Yeah, the school is undertaking some renovations. Ahead of our arrival in September. How cool is that? That's extremely cool. So, this is us trying to make sure our academics are in place in September, and this is a school trying to make sure that the environment is conducive and safe for our arrivals. I mean, it's more than I bargained for. This is really, really a big school. It's really a big school. So, just walking. Okay, and I've located the library, and now the direction I use in locating the library also says that um, the post room is way ahead. But I still don't understand because they are not using the post room as per se. They are using the names of buildings, like we've got vain buildings, we've got Richard buildings. Something like that. Yeah. I remember the Vane building very well because that's where I went to. The rest of the buildings have a name. So they're not called like the way we call it in our home country. Like this is library, this is library building, this is a medical building, this is a shared building, this is that one building. Everything is just jammed, packed together. So... A different naming rather not packed together like that so that's just basically it was there 
Yeah. That gentleman is taking me himself to the security post. The security post will be the one to answer most of your questions. In case you get lost or you try to locate somewhere. And funny enough, it's not it's not in um on Google Map at all. So this is a security post. Like this is the first building coming to the University of Hall. I open the door and this or that slide gets opened. And then I look at the reception, nobody is seated there. And I said, Someone will definitely be sitting in the office. And so again everywhere was quiet. I got scared. I said, Ah, should not be like I went that they haunted house. <laughs> I mean yeah, we were so quiet. I didn't want to enter the haunted house I beg. So luckily I located an instruction manual that said I should ring the bell for security to come up. I thought that if I ring the bell, the, the, bell, the bell would just ring to just me, but no. I don't really know how that works. So this is him trying to tell me to go to the back of the building. That is where the post room is. So now the post room is within building that's behind the vein building. So, he was kind enough to help me carry my, so sorry, he was kind enough to just show me where it is and carry me directly there, my father take me directly there. So that's just it. Yeah. So I go to the post room to collect my baggage. Yeah, he's directed me and said, This is where I need to go to. So I went there quite all right. I imagine the other layer manner at which the cars are assembled. Those are all the four causes. Here, yeah, I've gotten to the post room and I took my baggage. Thank you for watching.